Aloha and welcome Tiki Surf Guy is here on the show. Dude, how's it going? All the way from Sunset Beach, Hawaii. What's going on, Tiki Surf Guy? Not a whole lot. How are you? Now, for those of people out there who aren't familiar with Tiki Surf Guy, you're like a big thing on like Instagram now. You have this awesome band called Tur not Turkey, but Tiki Surf Guy. Now, give us the 411 on Tiki Surf Guy. Well, you know, it's uh, surf rock and roll. Everybody loves the surf rock and roll, the ventures, the, uh, the safaris. Uh, just trying to modernize that whole concept and bring it into the 21st century and having a lot of fun. What about the Beach Boys? What about the Beach Boys? Well, well aren't they like, they're on the surf, they're on the beach. That is true. Uncle Jesse's going to need a gig now that the Fuller House is gone, thanks to Aunt Becky. Yeah, yep, 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 yep. So, well, you know, he was never really a, a true Beach Boy. He wasn't really a true Beach Boy? Now, what makes you really a true Beach Boy? Well, I think you have to be one of those uh, brothers. The, you know, they were, they were all related except for like one of them. The I old guess. guys? They're like the Bee Gees of the beach, aren't they? Exactly. Now, is there a reason you guys are hiding your identities under the tiki mask? Are you wanted by anybody? No, 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 no. It's just, uh, you know, it's a gimmick. Well, we, 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 know, we love the word gimmicks down here. Yeah, we do. Now, how do we know that you aren't really the beach boys out there trying to uh, get a little extra side cash on the side? You don't. We don't know that. We, you could be. I well, could be Brian Wilson for all you guys know. You could be Uncle Jesse for all we know. Now, you got that lay down there, Colonel, down there. Have you ever been to Hawaii? No, I haven't. Would you like to go to Hawaii? Yes, I will. How, why would you like to go to Hawaii? I want to go see all the fancy hula 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 ladies. The hula hula ladies down yeah. there. The hula hula ladies. The hula ladies. All right. A new vernacular down here. The hula hula ladies. Now, the reason you are here, Tiki Surf Guy, is you're going to debut to the world out there, the world premiere of your unbelievable video. So what we're going to do right now, we're going to run this beautiful bean footage. I'm 
Bravo. Bravo. Tiki Surf Guy, what a fantastic video is out there, but I have to say that Jay uh, Puppethead is the star of that video. Well, you know, he plays a prominent role in the video, but, you know, really I'm the guy who does all the work and, you know, directs him what he's to do and how he sings it and stuff like that. You know, he's just a hired puppet. He's about two feet tall, isn't he? Yeah, thereabouts. Now, I heard he has a big ego out there. That is, that is true. He, you know, he has that what they call LSD, lead singer disease. Lead singer disease, huh? Now, who is the most lead singer People disease? People say, I have a big head. You should see his big head. Well, I have seen his big head because, uh, you know, we've been to parties before out on uh, Sunset Beach out in Hawaii. Oh, those were legendary. Colonel legendary! Mon <laughs> Colonel Montana was not there because he does not like to fly 16,000 miles uh, on an empty stomach out there. Nothing but, empty about that stomach. Now, I've heard through the uh, social media world out there that there's a lot of, there's some conflict going on with you the other members of the band, and J.R. Uh, Puppet. Can you, can, can you just give us the 411 on this right now? Is there any truth to this? Well, you know, that, that Puppet Head guy, he's, uh, like I said, he's getting a little bit too uh, big for his britches, so to say. Does he have britches? He's a puppet. Well, you know, I don't know what this guy's talking about. I mean, I'm the brains of this operation. I'm a lyrical genius of the Einstein kind. I practically invented surf music. You gonna believe a tiki mask wearing wannabe? I think we all see where this is going. But don't both parties need to be creative in order to have a creative difference? I mean, didn't I see this guy on a bad Brady Bunch episode with Vincent Price? I mean, look at this guy. Has he no self-respect? He's been stuffing devil dogs into those tiki masks for years. I haven't gained a pound since I was sewn. I don't have a stitch of gray and the yarn on my head. I am the king of pop -its. And that's all I have to say about that. The one and the only Tiki Surf Guy!